Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Yes, would like that, actually. Talked about work earlier, time with special tasks group, studying genophage. It wasn't entirely honest. Lie of omission. Also, other kinds need to clear the air. Mission too important to keep secrets. Work on genophage was more than just study. I had a feeling you were holding something back. Apologies, classified information, but you've earned the full story. Need to know me, what I can do, what I did. Wasn't lying completely. Initially, just did recon, but... Uncovered data. Troubling. Krogan population was increasing at faster rate than expected. Krogan were adapting to genophage, overcoming disease. Did the Krogan evolve, or did some of their scientists develop a treatment? Krogan scientists? <laughs> Never met Krogan scientists worthy of term. No. Natural evolution. Krogan physiology incredibly durable. Organ redundancy, backup systems, cellular regeneration. Genophage, like any other natural hazard, Krogan evolved past it. What did your team do when it learned that the Krogan were overcoming the genophage? Personally led a science team. Geneticists, chemists, sociologists, mathematicians. Created new version of genophage. Released it onto Chanka, other Krogan-centric areas. Restabilized Krogan population. How did your genophage modification work? Krogan evolution attached garbage genetic code to genophage attack sites. Modification created other areas for garbage code to connect. Left sites clean, capable, running smoothly. How did you distribute the modified genophage? Covert drops, hospitals, clan centers, water supplies. Very difficult. Few Solarians on Tuchanka. Team got caught a few times. Had to fight free. <sighs> Messy. Better when things went as planned. You never considered other options? Hundreds. Thousands. Modified genophage offered best outcome. Stabilized population avoided publicity that could incite Krogan anger. Averted potential genocide or devastating war. Best solution for whole galaxy. Krogan included. If the Krogan are so dangerous, why not just sterilize them outright? Not a war criminal. Not a murderer. Genocide unnecessary. Krogan as a whole, violent, aggressive, still have outliers worth saving. Genophage modification protected galaxy, allowed Krogan chance to survive. Everyone wins. Good for us, good for them. I doubt you've told many people about this, Morton. I appreciate you letting me know. Wanted you to know I'm willing to do what's necessary. Should get back to work. Talk more later. Next time, tissue synthesis has to compile. Good for free time. Commander, can I help you with something? I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. If you want, Commander. Cerberus has ranks, but it's not the Alliance. No rules about fraternization. Your boat, your call. You want to get friendly with everyone? That's your business. Relax, Jacob. I'm just interested in what makes you tick. Anyone else said that, I'd walk away. Most Cerberus people try to play like the elusive man, hiding bullshit behind a smile. But you? I like what I've seen. I'll give you a shot. What do you want to know? Anyone waiting for you back home? Only child and no extended family. Never settled down. Didn't seem fair with this job. But you can't miss what you never had. You seem okay with taking a risk on me. Why? Soldiers like us know how important trust is to the crew. I'm not used to seeing it on a Cerberus ship. Definitely not from people they put in command. But you focus on more than the job. A threat this big, you can't just throw people at it blind. They need inspiration. There's a lot riding on this, but we can't give up everything. Not always a choice we get to make. Good to try, though. I gave it my best back in the Alliance. Got labeled a troublemaker. They were always on the lookout for disruptive types. Cerberus isn't any better. They just put more effort into hiding how much they spy on you. They'll have something to see by the time we're done. No doubt. We'll be right in the middle of whatever goes down. Anyway, I should get back to prep. Nice talking to you, Shepard. Let's do it again sometime. The elusive man wishes to speak to you in the debriefing room, Commander. 
Is it true we have a pod containing a baby Krogan down in the cargo hold? Not a baby. He's a full-grown super soldier, ready for combat. Please be careful if you decide to... birth him. His personality is completely unknown. Anyway, how may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. Take care. Commander, I very much enjoyed sharing that ice brandy with you. But I hope I wasn't too unprofessional. Brandy goes straight to my head. It's nice to see you let your hair down. Guess I hadn't realized how much those feelings needed airing. But I didn't give you much of a chance to vent. So tell me now. What do you think? Everyone's depending on us. We won't let them down. They just don't make them like you anymore, Shepard. Well, promise me we'll share a bottle every year. The next one is on me. I haven't had a meal that good in a long time. I didn't think Rupert had it in him. Commander, what can I do for you? You have a minute, Miranda? Of course. I'm just finishing an operation report. I'm impressed, Shepard. So far, things have gone exceptionally well. As Cerberus operations go, this is one of the best I've been a part of. Cerberus obviously has your loyalty. How did you get involved with them? I suppose you've earned the right to know. Do you remember when I told you how I was genetically altered? Well, that wasn't my choice. My father... created me. He's a very influential man and extremely controlling. He didn't want a daughter. He wanted a dynasty. I ran away as soon as I was old and brave enough. I went to Cerberus because I knew they could protect me. You seem capable of defending yourself. Why did you need Cerberus? My father invested a great deal in his dynasty. It wasn't a matter of just leaving. I knew he would continue to pursue his... investments. I assume that Cerberus approves of your enhanced abilities? Of course. Cerberus fully endorses anything that advances the cause of humanity. Genetic alterations included. But unlike my father and his own selfish reasons, Cerberus and the elusive man believe in a greater good. They see the bigger picture. And I feel like I have a purpose here. Who exactly is your father? A businessman. But a very wealthy one. It's ironic. My father believed deeply in a human positive agenda. He donated generously to Cerberus, before I joined them. That's how I first heard about Cerberus, through my father's connections. You've told me a lot about your father. What happened to your mother? I never had one. Most of my genetic material is based on my father's tissue. His Y chromosome was altered with an amalgam of desired traits from various sources. How arrogant can you be? The man is completely egomaniacal. Just another reason I had to get away from him. You talk about yourself like you're just a tool to be used. By your father? By Cerberus? Maybe. I like to know where I fit in the world. It helps me find meaning in how I was created. You are who you are, Miranda. You don't need to make excuses for it. That's easy for you to say. We've both been engineered for greatness, Shepard. The difference is, you were great before we rebuilt you. I'm great because of it. Your spirit and personality are what make you great. It's what makes anyone great. That's kind of you. I'm not sure I believe you, but thanks for saying it. Thanks for your time, Miranda. I'll talk to you later. Anytime, Commander.
Shepard, I think we have them. Horizon, one of our colonies in the Terminus systems, just went silent. If it isn't under attack, it soon will be. Has Morden delivered the countermeasure for the Seeker Swarms? Not yet. Let's hope he works well under pressure. There's something else you should know. One of your former crew, Ashley Williams. She's stationed on Horizon. Last I knew, Ash was Alliance. Why is she out in the Terminus systems? Officially, it's an outreach program to improve Alliance relation with the colonies. But they're up to something. And if they sent Chief Williams, it must be big. Perhaps you should take it up with her. The Collectors just happened to pick a colony with one of my former crew? I don't buy it. It shouldn't be a surprise the Collectors are interested in you, especially if they're working for the Reapers. They might be going after her to get to you. We should send a message to the Citadel. The Alliance can give us reinforcements. Not until you investigate. I don't want the Alliance getting in our way. Once you have the situation under control, I'll send the message personally. Send the coordinates. We'll head straight there. This is the most warning we've ever had, Shepard. Good luck. Joker, set a course for Horizon. I've got to go see the Professor. Aye, aye, Commander. Tell me you have something. Yes. Lilith. We've got a problem. Still can't calibrate the targeting matrix? Those defense towers are useless if we don't figure it out. Sorry, Chief. Getting our comm systems back online takes priority. Yeah. Okay. Surprised people haven't tried to blame that one on me, too. People out here don't trust the Alliance. It's nothing personal. What is that? Get everyone to the safe house. I'll cover you. Run!
brown side. Mort, you sure these armor upgrades will protect us from the Seeker Swarms? Certainty impossible, but in limited numbers should confuse detection make us invisible to swarms. In theory. In theory? Experimental technology only test is contact with Seeker Swarms. Look forward to seeing if you survive. <laughs> Close. Be right there. Commander, we're getting a interference. We can't maintain it. The collectors are disrupting communications. We're on our own now. Those things look like the husks the Geth used on Eden Prime. The Geth got that technology from Sovereign. These creatures used to be human. Is this what's left of the colonists? No. On Eden Prime, they used giant spikes to turn people into husks. Dragon's teeth. I don't see any here. These aren't the colonists. The collectors took them for something else. Live. The collectors must be experimenting on the colonists. What are they up to? Maybe it's better not to know all the gory details. The only way to find out is to stop them. These aren't the same creatures I fought on Eden Prime. They're more advanced. Evolved. I still die when you shoot them. The Collectors aren't getting away with more victims. Let's move out. Yes, sir. Coming! to be some kind of stasis field. It keeps you conscious, but completely helpless. They've been like this a long time.
company. Get out here, now. You're... you're human. What are you doing out here? You lead them right here! I cleared a path. You're lucky you're not in the hold of a collector ship right now. Those things are collectors? You mean, they're real? I thought they were just made up, you know, propaganda, to keep us in Alliance space. No, oh, they got Lilith. I, I saw her go down. Sten, too. They, they got damn near everybody. What's your name? What do you do here? Name's Delan. Mechanic. I came down to check on the main grid after we lost our comm signals. And I heard screaming. I looked outside and there were swarms of... bugs. Everyone they touched just froze. I, I, I sealed the doors. Damn it, it, it's the Alliance's fault. They stationed that Chief Williams here and built those defense towers. It made us a target. If you have defenses, we can use them against the Collector's ship. You'd need to calibrate the targeting system first. It's never worked right. We can figure it out. Just tell us where to find it. Head for the main transmitter on the other side of the colony. Pretty hard to miss. The targeting controls are at the base. You know this colony and the equipment. You better come with us. Not a chance in hell. You're just gonna let the collectors take your friends? I'm a mechanic. What am I supposed to do? Whack him with my wrench? I'll let you out, but I'm locking the door behind you. I'm not taking any chances. Good luck. I think you're gonna need it. Right behind you. We can use this. Surprise we haven't run across more frozen colonists. The collectors have already loaded them onto their ship. We're running out of time. I'm here. Understood. Normandy, you copy. Joker here. 
Signal's weak, Commander, but we got you. Time to show these things we give as good as we get. Edie, bring the defense towers online. Errors in the calibration software are easily rectified, but it will take time to bring the towers to full power. I recommend a defensive posture. I will not be able to mask the increased generator output. King of the hill with collectors. Great. We'll stop them. Easy enough. Maybe not. Enemy reinforcements closing in. I suggest you ready weapons. Enemy down! Hot dog! Intervention is necessary. We are your Jupiter yes. destiny. Get away! There's nothing we can do. They're gone. Half the colony's in there! They took Egan and Sam and, and Lilith! Do something! I didn't want it to end this way. I did what I could. Don't beat yourself up, Shepard. Shepard? Wait. I know that name. Sure, I remember you. You're some type of big alliance hero. Commander Shepard. 
captain of the Normandy, the first human specter, savior of the Citadel. You're in the presence of a god, Delan, back from the dead. Oh, the good people we lost and you get left behind. Figures. Screw this. I'm done with you Alliance types. I thought you were dead, Commander. We all did. It's been too long, Ash. How have you been? That's it? You show up after two years and act like nothing's happened? I would have followed you anywhere, Commander. I thought you were gone. I... You were more than our Commander. Why didn't you try to contact me? Why didn't you let me know you were alive? I was out for two years. You've moved on with your career and your life. Why reopen old wounds? I moved on. But here you are, pulling me back in. And now we've got reports about you and Cerberus. Reports? So much for security. Alliance Intel said Cerberus could be behind our missing colonies. I got a tip that this one could be the next to get hit. I went to Anderson, but he wouldn't talk. But there were rumors that you weren't dead. Worse, that you were working for the enemy. Building the defense towers was just a cover story. The Alliance sent you here to investigate me, didn't they? I was sent here to investigate Cerberus, not you. I wanted to believe you were alive. I just never expected anything like this. You've turned your back on everything we stood for. Ash, you know me. You know I'd only do this for the right reason. You saw it yourself. The Collectors are targeting human colonies, and they're working with the Reapers. I'd like to believe you, Shepard, but I don't trust Cerberus. And it worries me that you do. What did they do to you? What if they're behind it? What if they're the ones working with the Collectors? Typical Alliance attitude. You're so focused on Cerberus that you're blind to the real threat. You're letting how you feel about their history get in the way of facts. Or maybe you feel like you owe Cerberus because they saved you. Maybe it's you. Doesn't matter. I still know where my loyalties lie. I'm an Alliance soldier. It's in my blood. I'm reporting back to the Citadel. I'll let them decide if they believe your story. I could use someone like you and my crew, Ash. It'll be just like old times. No, it won't. I'm no fan of aliens, but Cerberus has a history of being extremist. I'll never work for a group like that. So long, Commander. Good luck. Joker, send the shuttle to pick us up. I've had enough of this colony. Shepard, good work on Horizon. Hopefully the Collectors will think twice before attacking another colony. It's not a victory. We interrupted the Collectors, but they still abducted half the colony. That's better than an entire colony, and more than we've accomplished since the abductions began. The Collectors will be more careful now, but I think we can find another way to lure them in. Ash said the Alliance got a tip about me and Cerberus. Is that you? I may have let it slip that you were alive, and with Cerberus. You risked the lives of my friend, my crew, and that entire colony? Just to lure the Collectors there? A calculated risk. I suspected the Collectors were looking for you, or people connected to you. Now I know for certain. I told you I wouldn't sit and wait while the Reapers and Collectors gather strength. Besides, they would have hit another colony eventually, and without a way to predict which one, they would have abducted everyone. We have to make sure they don't abduct anyone else. I want the Collectors stopped for that very reason. That's why we're doing this, Shepard. I'm devoting all resources to finding a way through the Omega-4 Relay. We have to hit them where they live. Your team will need to be strong, as will their resolve. There's no looking back. The same goes for you. Can I assume you've put your past relationships behind you? None of your damn business. If it affects the mission, better you should leave it behind. Shepard, 
Once you find a way through the Omega-4 relay to the Collector homeworld, there's no guarantee you'll return. To have any hope of surviving, you and your entire team must be fully committed to this. I'll make sure they're ready, one way or the other. The Collectors won't know what hit them. I trust you know what you're doing. I just want to be clear about your odds. I've forwarded three more dossiers. Keep building your team while I find a way through the relay. And be careful, Shepard. The Collectors will be watching you. I guess we're really gonna do it. Hit the Omega-4 relay. Take the fight to the Collectors in person. Looking forward to the action. After seeing what those bastards did on Horizon, though, makes you think. I need you sharp and focused if we're gonna get this done, Taylor. That's what I meant, Commander. I don't want any distractions when we hit the relay. Gonna go take care of a little unfinished business. I imagine everyone else is, too. Getting some closure, you know? <laughs> 